Virgo, hi, welcome to my channel, Beyond the Moon. I am doing a peek at your person, love tarot reading. All right, so Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, if this does not resonate, please check your other placements for messages there. Feel free to cross-watch, but don't force anything to fit, okay? Some messages may be for you, some may not. Take what resonates, leave the rest. All right, Virgo, stick around till the end. I'm going to pull some zodiac signs, numbers, letters to see who it is you're dealing with. And also, please subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment below if you'd like, and if you'd like to book a personal reading, information's in the description box below. Virgo, let's get into your reading. Wow, okay. Your overall energy, uh, fork in the road and abandoned. All right, so I feel like you're at a crossroads here. You may have, you, you may be feeling abandoned. Someone may have walked away, um, left you in the dark, left you hanging here. And now you're kind of like, what do I do? I'm at a crossroads. I do feel like you are trying to either manifest, heal, meditate, that kind of a thing. We also have unfinished symphony, unfinished business. I feel like this isn't done yet. Um, your person, uh, Virgo, has all that glitters, peace, serendipity, chop wood, and milk and honey. So this person may have been wearing a false self mask. All that glitters isn't gold. I can take that in a negative context, like they weren't being their true selves to you and hiding stuff from you. Or I can take it as this person wasn't sharing their feelings, emotions, and they were wearing a false mask. I do have serendipity, peace with an egg, a peaceful new beginning, uh, chop wood, putting in work and effort, and milk and honey. I feel like this person, Virgo, is realizing your value and your worth. Um, I feel like there is going to be a new beginning here for you. And some of you are like, heck no, 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 no. Stick around. This could be somebody new. We'll see. All right. Um, angel numbers. I'm seeing a lot of ones. So that could be a new beginning. Look up uh, angel number 1111. That is also manifestation too. So I feel like there is something that you're manifesting here. I'm also seeing some fives, which is conflict, but angel numbers have a different meaning for that, which it's actually, I think, a big positive change is happening for you. So let's get into your reading, Virgo, see what's going on. All right, current energies for Virgo's person. What's going on? Putting down a burden, ten of wands, the world, closing out a cycle, or you guys could live at, live at a distance. Seven of Pentacles, this person's planting seeds. They're putting a burden down, um, Virgo, and planting some seeds, maybe closing out some kind of a cycle here. <clears throat> Keep in mind, Virgo, when I say your person's energy, it could be yours, so feel free to flip-flop and reverse it, okay? All right, what else? What else is going on? Six of Swords. Came out in the reverse. They may have some stuck, stagnant energy they're trying to work through right now. What else is going on? What else is going on, Virgo's person? I'm not going to take all that, but that is your energy. With a tower, rejection, options. Okay. Was this person treating you as an option and ended up rejecting you, causing a tower moment? Hmm. Let's see. Well, they have regrets. If they did, five of cups, sadness, loss, regret, remorse. I feel like they want to come back around and put in some work and effort here, Virgo. Yep, and what did I just say? Eight of pentacles. They want to put in work and effort. Funny. <laughs> Funny how energies come out. They could be waiting, though. You, yeah, your guard is up. Ooh. Could be a Leo, Aries, Sag coming towards you, Virgo, or somebody that is very passionate, fiery, attractive, flirty, fun, outgoing, driven. They're waiting, though, to take action. They may feel your, your wall is up, your guard is up right now. I feel like they may have hurt you. Let's see what was blocking this. Blockages for Virgo and their person. Blockages. Oh, Virgo. Blockages, blockages. If this is somebody new, they could be closing out a cycle um, <clears throat> with somebody else. Taking out resonates. The chariot. Again, something with maybe travel, distance. Uh, that's Cancerian energy. Here you are. 
Did you put a stop to this? Because of a tower moment? Page of Pentacles could be an age difference. If not, this person maybe was only offering page level stability. Small, small stability. King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Uh, an air sign could have been in the way. Or somebody was very like kind of cold and cut off here. Let's see what else was blocking this. That's too many. What else was blocking this for Virgo? Something from the past. Eight of Cups, the Hermit. Did somebody go ghost here? Someone could have went, tried to go back to the past. So they could have left you, abandoned you, and went back to the past or vice versa. I feel like it didn't work out. I feel like it backfired here. Could be something to do with children, um, but I feel like it's more somebody from the past. They thought it was going to work out and it did not work out. And in the meantime, they left you over here hanging, causing a tower moment. Oh boy, Virgo. All right, let's see. How does this person feel about you? How does this person feel about Virgo? So I have um, Air, uh, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Scorpio, Cancer, Energies, Virgo too. You, you're here too. All right, how does this person feel about you, Virgo? How do they feel? Oh, 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 judgment, reconciliation, a wake up call, an aha moment, an epiphany, scorpionic energy. Either they want to reconcile with you or you gave them a wake up call or both. The full Aries energy. I feel like they want to take a leap of faith in your direction, uh, Virgo. I was going to say Leo and I don't know why. Could be dealing with a Leo. <laughs> they were juggling uh if it wasn't a third party which could be a person place or thing i feel like they were kind of like should i shouldn't i should i shouldn't i i do feel they went back to somebody from the past like an ex came back and they got tempted and fell for it and it didn't work out um the hanged man pisces energy they definitely are having some change in perspective here you gave them a wake-up call if they ghosted you, blocked you, cut off communication, I feel like they're going to come back around with that because they've had this epiphany. Now they're trying to find some strength and courage to come back to you after they cut you off. They have regrets. You made them happy. And there you are. And they're realizing that. How else do they feel? How else do they feel? <clears throat> You made them happy. You were their son, Virgo. You know? Yep. All right. They want commitment. It's oh, They choose you, the lovers. They're feeling a soulmate bond. Three of Pentacles. That's taking your thoughts, visions, dreams, manifestations, and turning them into reality. Working as a team. Getting on the same page. Building towards the same future. Eight of Wands. That's communication about some kind of commitment here. I feel like they choose you. You could be dealing with a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, a water sign. If not, I feel like this is them having some emotions towards you and seeing your value, seeing your worth, and knowing what it is that they've lost. Yeah, they could have been toxic because they were breadcrumbing or giving to two, but wow, look. They're coming towards you. They are coming towards you, and I feel like they're dropping any, like, toxic energy. Wow. Well, let's see. What are you going to do? What are you going to do, Virgo? Uh, keep in mind, you have free will. So do they. So this could change. Make your own decisions. I'm not here to tell you what to do. Virgo, outcome. What's the outcome here for Virgo? All right. Waiting. Somebody's waiting. I know they're waiting for the right time. Divine timing, temperance, Sagittarius energy, going with the flow in time, divine timing, patience, because there was chaos and conflict or self-sabotage going on here. Somebody might be conflicted in their thoughts. I feel like it's you because you're at the fork in the road here. You may have another option. I don't know. We'll see what comes out. 
Reconciliation, again, Scorpionic energy, the hanged man, Pisces energy. Here we go again, having regrets because they rejected you. So now they want to communicate to get this wheel going. Some of you are really being protective of your energy, though. Good for you. Some of you are really like, I don't know. I don't know if I want to move this forward. You rejected me. You, you ghosted me. You didn't communicate. You didn't tell me anything. You just left me in the dark. That's why they're waiting. They, they want to come back. They don't know what to say or what to do. They, they want a new beginning, a peaceful new beginning at that. They see your value, your worth. You made them happy. They could be um, looking for signs, synchronicities, following number patterns. They want to level up with you. Look, here you are. Yeah, they could be feeling stuck now. Like their hands are tied. There's nothing they can do because I feel like you have your wall up big time with this person. This is the 11-11 make a wish, which is coming true. Soulmate, house, home, leveling up, next level of commitment. Let's be exclusive. I want to do this. You know, I feel like. What are you going to do, Virgo? What are you going to do? You're hanging back. They are, they are too. So there could be some stuck stagnant energy still. They may have reached out. If they haven't, they're going to. Definitely going to. And I usually, I'm like, they're just going to reach out and send a small little text like, hey, what's up? How are no, that's not how this is going to go down. This person, I feel, is going to come like rushing in if they haven't already. They have big, big, big regrets here. Wow. Let me, um... Who, who's coming towards Virgo in the near future? Let me see if there's somebody else. Who's coming towards Virgo in the near future? Ace of Wands, passionate new beginning. Maybe with this person that you cut off and cut out, this Queen of Swords here, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, a lot of air as far as um, court cards. I feel like there's a strong air sign in your energy. Doesn't have to be, though. It could just be you cutting somebody off, cutting them out. But who's coming towards you? Someone where there's a lot of attraction, passion, chemistry. It's this person. <laughs> it's this person, Virgo. It's the same person. You're still indecided. Oh, well, oh, oh, I take it back. I take it back. I take it back. You might stay single for a little bit here. Nine of Pentacles. You could have a Taurus Virgo Capricorn coming towards you or somebody that wants long term, somebody that is ready for commitment and they're stable. I don't think there's going to be like games being played. So this could be your person's energy here. They see your value, your worth. You make them happy. They could be like a lucky person or seeing signs, synchronicities putting in work and effort and this other person wasn't who you thought they were. So take it how it resonates because there's a couple things going on here in your love life, Virgo. All right, let's see. Biggest obstacle, the outsider being abandoned, left out in the cold, feeling like this person may have made you feel like you didn't belong or they locked you out, shut you out, ghosted you, blocked you. So overcoming that conditioning and flowering, will this blossom? Will this bloom? Will this grow? Um, conditioning, did this person project things onto you, blame you, point the finger at you, or um, do they have some conditioning that they need to heal from? Like they don't know how to give and receive love. They maybe have an insecurity, so they look elsewhere for love, things like that going on. So, mm. all right, what else for Virgo? Messages for Virgo, cycles, you yeah, false starts, false starts, false starts. Memories, they're thinking about you. All right, cycles, momentum, force, life cycles. Stay grounded in the now. Spring, your love is blooming, so flowering. Creativity, inspiration, productivity, creation. Bring out the greatness with, within. 
Beliefs, similar clashing belief systems can bring you together, tear you apart in perception, red flags, delusion, perspective. Also see through your own false beliefs here. There we go, or they need to. Take it how it resonates. All right, what would this person want to say to you, Virgo? What do they want to say? I know I messed everything up. I'm becoming a better person. Hmm. I wish things could be different. We both know I am not the one for you. That could be you saying that to them. Like I, because I know you're at you're at a crossroads. Maybe you're realizing I'm not I'm not the one for you you speak to me through music you came closer than anyone it's time for me to heal now you and I were too young I remember every day of every detail of that day I wish I could take back my words that could be why a lot of air came out there could have been a really harsh argument between the two of you so yeah it resonates all right let's get some names here uh letters so could be first middle last name initial could spell a name could spell a word of significance if their first and last name have the same letter feel free to duplicate it because they only have one of each all right <laughs> we have z r p h a j x c w y d q l i t and f so Z R P H A J X C W D Q Y L I F T. That spells lift. <laughs> Just saying. All right. Uh, let's get some numbers. Could be birthday, anniversary, uh, an age, a number of significance, angel numbers, number of days, months, weeks, years. Place it where you see fit. All right. We have one, three, eight, and nine. So it could be the 1st, the 3rd, 13th, 18th, 19th, um, 8th or 9th of any month. So 1, 3, 8, 9, January, March, September, and August. All right, zodiac signs. Could be their um, sun, sun sign, could be strong placements in their chart, could be something happening during that season, like Virgo season, for instance. All right, what do we got? We got... Leo, Pisces, Gemini, Pisces again. So double Pisces, Gemini, Leo, Pisces again. Wow. And Aquarius. All right. Aquarius did show up. All right. Um, Virgo, that is what I have for you this week. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment below. If you'd like to book a personal reading, information's in the description box below. And until next time, Virgo, love and light. Take care.